Hey, good morning peeps. It's a day before Armstrong Gold. Um, I'm gonna catch a quick shower just to feel a little bit better. It's been a late night travel last night. Uh, didn't sleep that well. Watched uh, Clint Hendricks do an amazing podium at the Commonwealth Games um, in Australia. Um, and he has been my teammate and a close friend to me. Um, and I'm really happy for him. Hats off to, to Clint. Give him a, a like, follow. Uh, anyway, uh, need to get to breakfast at 9 o'clock and be on par with the convocation. Um, so for those that don't know, um, breakfast done, <laughs> um, it's my first time racing in Belgium um, on these specific roads as well. Um, it's going to be really interesting, 200, like I said, 264 kilometers, 33 climbs. Um, we're doing our pre-race right now, uh, probably about an hour and a half, two hours, um, whatever suits for you. Nothing that you do now is going to make you more fit or change anything. Um, in the results tomorrow um, the the hard work's done uh, if you've got the legs um, you've got them if you don't you don't you can be on a bad day a good day um, there's so many variables how you sleep um, how your stomach is the next day whatever um, but we're gonna go enjoy our pre-race ride do some uh, activation some oaks do 40 20 40 20 that means 40 seconds sprints 20 seconds recover um, I like doing a little bit of a longer interval at two minutes, um, which works quite well for me, which my coach uh, John has uh, prescribed to me. So that's also pretty cool. Um, whatever works for you in the pre-race ride, um, you need to learn your body. And um, the biggest thing is not to go too hard and just make sure to get your heart rate up, down, up, down. Um, yeah, and that's it and get enough rest, um, go sleep as early as possible, even if you're really good at sleeping, get a get an afternoon nap, and uh, obviously enjoy your cycling a lot as well. Okay, so it's about 20 minutes before our pre-race ride. Um, I'd quickly like to show you something. Um, first things first, um, obviously you need to check the weather, um, how it looks outside. As you can see, it is it's nine degrees out there, but uh, the, the wind chill factor, there's not a lot of wind, which means uh, you don't necessarily have to dress that warm. The wind really makes a big difference. You don't just focus on how many degrees it is. And then obviously I'll go on the team emails now, um, check out the daily convocation that was sent. Today is really simple. Um, there's not much going on because it's not a tour. Um, it's a one day event. Okay, okay, obviously staff have a lot of responsibilities, but what I mean with it's not such a bad busy schedule, um, there you can see just uh, what times we're eating, what time uh, we're going to train, what time we need to be ready for massage and the rest is all free time just to relax and get your head right. <music> got new stuff why don't I have new stuff <laughs> okay about 30 minutes into our ride here with Slava and uh, we're just enjoying the little road and uh, it's really beautiful Hey ducklings. But look, they, no, no, if you go down, look to the ship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see it's going. On the side you can yeah. see the, the level is... Okay, so this ship is going down. And then it's going through this tunnel here. All the way 